So Microsoft just patented this new tech that could bring us one step closer to black mirror levels of techno necromancy. Let's talk about this. This is Tone's Take with your host, Tony Davis. Hey guys, good evening and thanks for joining. We are now one step closer to techno necromancy. Tech, tech, no, ro to, romant, to, whatever you want to call it. Microsoft is doing it. Black Mirror be damned. So if you haven't seen the Black Mirror episode titled Be Right Back, where this girl is given the opportunity to recreate her dead boyfriend digitally, you got to watch it because this is exactly what Microsoft is doing. They just patented this technology that you know they said that hey yeah we're, we're gonna do this let me let me just read to you exactly what this technology does so the the name of the patent is creating a conversational chat bot of a specific person i don't know why i want to say chat box but anyway if you read the abstract which i'll you know i'll post it up here as well they're basically create you know examples of the present disclosure describe systems and methods of creating a conversational chat bot of a specific person and they go into saying that they'll they can use images voice data social media posts anything that's out there that they can collect data of they can make a chat bot of this person and then they you know they say they can make a 2d aspect a 3d aspect i mean they just go in basically saying yeah we're gonna do black mirror Stuff, type stuff and you can look at the patent diagrams start uh receive request then access social data then create personality then train the chat bot one guy on twitter say tech companies still think black mirror is a blueprint not a cautionary tale it, ca it caught microsoft's attention because then you had the uh the manager of ai programs at microsoft tim o'brien come back and respond and you know he had a few responses to him and his final response was yeah i get it no worries at any rate confirmed that there's no plans for this but if i ever get a job writing for black mirror i'll know to go to the uspto website for story ideas and i'm just like yeah bs you know that microsoft is doing this tim why are you lying to us um and it's it's interesting because you know we've i, I feel like we have this desire to you know bring back people from the dead for different reasons. We, we've done it with celebrities like Whitney Houston, like Tupac Shakur, like Carrie Fisher um, on, you know, 3D holograms and, and on stage and in movie theaters, Carrie Fisher reprising her role as Princess Leia and Star Wars films, it's happening. And then you've also got this one lady, uh, Eugenia Coida, she's the co-founder and CEO of a software company and an app called Replica, which if you go to replica with a K dot AI, it's apparently this app that is a, a, a digital human being that you can talk to and have real conversations with. Akoida, she created this chat bot after she saw what happened in Black Mirror. She lost her best friend the same way and she had a slew of text messages that she then went through, put them in an algorithm, worked with some data scientists, AI scientists, whatever, and was able to create this thing. So it's not like it's not being done and it's not like it can't be done. It's should it be done? You know, we go into that whole Jurassic Park argument. You, we were so interested in the fact that we could do it. No one asked if we should do it. And so I wonder, should we be doing this? Should we be bringing this type of technology where you can bring back someone from the dead, you can bring back grandma, or you can bring back, you know, your dead spouse, whatever it might be. Is it is it right? Would, would, you, would you do it? And how much money? Because let me know. I'll start a business in it. I would love to know your thoughts on this whole thing, and I will see you all tomorrow. Peace out.